In today's video, we're gonna be building a $5 fishing kit out of Walmart's fishing section. If you guys are new to the channel, be sure to smash that subscribe button, hit the like button, and comment down below. If you guys are wondering why my face is puffy, my allergies have been kind of bugging me for some reason. I'm like feeling a little weird, like the eyes are all puffy, the face is kind of puffy up. I really don't know. But anyways, we're gonna be going through the Walmart fishing section today, building a $5 fishing kit, $5. In the last video, we used the Academy $5 fishing kit, and I was like, why not follow it up with this one, and I, you know, build our own $5 fishing kit. One thing I'm gonna say, I am not going to be counting this towards the $5 price. The $5 price is just with the lures that we're gonna put into this box. It might end up being this small, it might end up being that small, it might, up in, it might be any of these. Nice. But, that's for the end. We're gonna look at our lures, see what we can get for $5, baby. $5, this is balling on the budget. I was about to say, this would be so cool to put in there, like have some little crank baits and stuff, but this whole kit for these three are $9 or $10 itself. That's just gonna show us, we're building a $5 kit, guys. Let's see what we can do. We're gonna have to get lures that are obviously around a dollar and it's a fishing kit. You know, we're not just buying one or two baits. We're trying to put, you know, three to four to five if we can even get there. I don't think we can get five for $5. I think we can, but if we really want a variety, and we have to buy hooks and weights if we're doing like soft plastics. I don't know, let's go ahead and look and see what they got. I know they have some $1 lures in here, but I don't know how many. But let's go ahead and look at the Walmart brand. So right here, we have a jerk bait. That's, that's see, that's like $2. It's still like, a, I mean, it's $1.97. It shows a dollar, but that's $2. Should we count? Eh, but these are only $1.22. Should we just say these are a dollar? How should we do this? This is $2, definitely. I'm, I'm not saying that's a dollar, that's $2. We can say this is a dollar. We're gonna round them over. So let's pick out our first bait. Hmm. All right, so you guys know the $1 spinner baits. We've done a few videos on them. I know Norm's done some videos on them. We've all done some videos on the $1 Walmart spinner baits. So we're gonna have to go with one of these today. I think we're gonna get this one right here. It's got a willow leaf blade and it's just a plain white one. That's gonna be cool. That is our first lure. This is only $1, literally $1 even right here. Set it right there. I think we might grab a buzz bait. I know they have one in here. Boom. Right there, we got a buzz bait and a spinner bait for only $2 right there. A dollar a piece, $2 right there for these two. Now that's fishing on a budget right there. $2. We're going to set these right there to build our $5 kit. Now let's see what else. We need some soft plastics, okay? We got two hard bait lures. We got a spinner bait and we got a buzz bait. Buzz bait's top water, you know, so we got a top water and we got a moving bait. Now we need a soft plastic. You know, we're covering the top, covering the middle. Now we gotta cover the bottom. So let's see what they got. So between all the price ranges, these are around $2, $4, about $4, $6. That's over our whole tackle box budget right there. Just with this one pack is already $6.30. All right, these are $3, $2. Let's see, what is the cheapest out of all these? I would say, usually I'd say these. These are $2.86, so these are pretty much three bucks still. Hum, this is gonna be a tough one to be honest with you. I thought there would be some cheaper soft plastics. Sadly, there isn't. This is actually $5 itself. This is a little kit. Well, trick worm kit, that's $5 right there, four fifty-six. dollars I'm not gonna lie, I've been looking at everything for quite a minute. I'm getting a little stressed, man. This is harder than I thought to build a $5 fishing kit. I thought there would be, you know, maybe some soft plastics like a pack of worms or whatever. That's over here, that's, you know, around a dollar. But there is one thing that I saw and we've used it in some other videos, which is the ready for action worm. The ready for, boy, he's ready for the action. Look at this guy. Look at this right here. This is only 96 cents. And those are for these worms right here, okay? And then you can get this, and it's $1.42, and it's got like the spinners and the hooks on it. But I think we might go with this, and what we might end up doing is just grabbing a shaky head at home or something and using this for the kit. But this is probably gonna be the cheapest pack of worms out of all these. You know, this is 96 cents, around a dollar. We're gonna call this a dollar right here. And the rest of these, like the cheapest they go is around $3. Ooh. I think we might have to risk it for this one. This is $2.16 for some reason. So a dollar more, hold up. So if I'm just looking at this correct, correctly, this is a dollar, this is $2, okay? 12 of them come in this pack. And these are these are some premium soft plastics. Like I've, I've used these before, I've caught fish on them. They catch fish. These, I don't know too much about, man. I really don't. You get three worms for a dollar. I can get 12 of these crawls 
for two dollars. So if I'm thinking about it, you know, I could buy two of these. I have six of them. I got 12 of these bad boys. I think we're gonna have to go with these. We're gonna put this guy back, but that means we're already at four dollars. Right here, we're just at four dollars. So let's go ahead and put these guys back. I feel like that's definitely the better choice with the crawls. I think I'm gonna put the buzz bait back. We don't really need the buzz bait, okay? We do need the spinner bait though. So we got a bottom bait now. These are two dollars. And we got a spinner bait. This is a dollar. We're at three dollars right now. We have two dollars left. I think for one of the dollars, we're gonna have to go with the soft body swim bait right here. And these are already like pre-built right here. You know, they already got a hook in them, they got the weight, the whole deal. It's just a regular basic swim bait just for a dollar. Dollar twenty-two. We're gonna round that to a dollar, so that's one dollar, okay? Let's kind of get something wild. This is like the wildest looking color I've seen. But this one's pretty wild too. Hmm. I like that one. Let's go with this one. All right, dollar swim baits, dollar spinner bait, two dollar pack of crawls. We're at four dollars. Now we need one more lure. So these down here got some rattle traps. I really want like a solid moving bait with treble hooks. There's really not that many. Like usually you see the Walmart brand, but they don't really have it. Rather than the spinner baits and buzz baits, I mean they got some up here. Those are three dollars. Um, see they have the Ozark trails. That's usually what I would get, but that's still two dollars. I think we're gonna go with this down here. And this is two dollars as well we're gonna have to go a dollar over on this one but you know i think it'll end up being worth it we're gonna grab this rattle trap which is a kind of a weird color but you know what i'm trying to make this thing a little wacky man we're going with that weird looking five dollar fishing kit deal boom right there four lures rattle trap spinner bait crawls swim baits this is going to be going in the five dollar fishing kit let's go ahead and grab the kit and get onto the lake i think we're going to go with this moderate one right here we're going to grab this guy Give us a little bit more room. We might end up piling some more stuff in here, but that's the little $5 deal. So boys and girls, we have just made it home. Let's go ahead and start building this $5 fishing kit, baby. I'm excited about this one. This is gonna be cool. You know, we're gonna build this kit. We're gonna go out fishing a little bit, use some of the baits in there and see if we can catch some fish on it. You know, this is different. If you guys wanna see some more tackle kit build videos, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button if you guys haven't already. If we get this video to 5,000 likes, I got a really great idea. Real, like a such a good idea it's going to take a while for it to get here but i have a killer idea that you guys are just going to love so give this video the 5,000 likes if you could but let's go ahead and take this thing apart put the baits in there see what we're working with all right i'm excited like i said i did not count this towards it five dollars obviously like this is like three or four dollars itself so you know just don't worry about that one but i did get these for like two dollars as you guys saw which is a pretty good steal not gonna lie and then i got the rattle trap as you guys saw the old swim baits we got two in there and then the old spinner bait which is great as well and uh, those are gonna be the lures that we're gonna put up in here I want to see how you know they end up fitting in because like I said there's a good bit of work there's a, a good bit of worm what the heck am I saying there's a good bit of space in this tackle kit and we might end up adding a little bit more stuff that I just have sitting around just so it looks a little better because I already know I mean we have four little things that we're gonna put in this whole kit but let's go ahead get a knife cut these and we're gonna try to figure out you know the placement of all these lures all right rattle trap two swim baits which we're gonna put right there this double kill right there boys for a dollar we got two little old swim baits yes sir and then we're gonna put the spinner bait right there yes sir let's see what else we got where can we put these crawls so there we go after all the lures that we ended up buying putting them in here this is the five dollar fishing kit balling on a budget baby Balling on a budget got the crawls got the route trap swim baits spinner bait But as you guys can tell it is a little bit empty I think I'm gonna grab some other soft plastics just to put in there just to have and uh, we're gonna split it up like this Another thing soft plastic soft plastic soft plastic down here is gonna be hooks and weights wait till you guys see what I just made we added a little bit, okay? I know this is the $5 fishing kit, but we had to add something to it. This isn't a part of the $5, but you know, we, we did have to make it look a little good, man. So let me show you guys what I did. All right, look at this, okay? And you guys are probably saying, Noah, this is the ugliest fishing kit ever. And you're curve, I mean, this is pretty ugly. I'm not gonna lie, but let me show you guys what I added in. So I added some yellow trick worms, which you guys are probably thinking, Noah, why the heck did you add some dang banana? trick worms up in here boys and uh the reason being is because it really slays them i'm not gonna lie these things slam okay got some standard trick worms that we could easily add on a little shaky head those are a little smaller obviously our crawls rattle trap 
down here I had to add a little sexy six cents square bill I just added that in okay it made it look good you know what I'm saying that just made it look complete with that guy in there and that guy in there and this whole deal and then down here as you guys can tell we have the hooks the weights and then the rest of the stuff that we ended up buying so right here is the five dollar section right here are the add-ons that we added to the kit but needless to say it's pretty cool you know pretty inexpensive nice but my whole point of this video is you can always get stuff cheap, guys. If you guys are seriously on a budget, I mean just killing it on a budget, you can always get with this type of stuff right here. I added this just to fill up the tackle box, but uh, yeah, let's go ahead and take this thing. Let's tie up a few of these baits on. Let's see if we can catch some fish on it. I think I'm going to start off with this crawl right here. We're going to put it up on a little Texas rig, and we're going to go fish it. All right, boys, we got the fishing kit. We just going to set it right there. Easy to bring along with us. Only $5. Yes, we got some more stuff in there. I understand that. But, okay, so this is what I did. I already had a shaky head on my rod, so I just rigged that crawl that we bought. Just on a shaky head. Pretty basic. You know, I was going to put it on a Texas rig, and I'd go from there. But let me tell you something about this crawl. I made a video on it about a year ago, and the reason I bought this is because I put the buzz bait back, okay? Now listen to me. This crawl, if you put it on a Texas rig, you can run it exactly like a little top water. See that? It's like a little tiny horny toad on top. This is a shaky head, so it's a little bit different. But if you put this on a, a Texas rig, I'm telling you, this is a type of bait that you can reel on the top of the water. You can work it on the bottom. Look at that. Look how good that looks. Just like that. It's almost like a little buzz bait. It's like a little tiny horny toad. So you can reel this thing on top of the water. You can swim it just like this. It actually will swim really good on a shaky head. And then you can also work it on the bottom. That's why I love this crawl and it's very versatile. So anyways, with that being said, if you guys wanna check out that video, I'll leave it in the description box below. It's probably the, one of the most helpful videos I've ever posted on the channel. Without further ado, let's go ahead and start fishing, guys. Let's see if we can catch one. Fishing has been really tough since the hurricane. I mean, very tough. I don't know what the fish are doing. They've been really weird, but you know, I guess we just have to find out. You see that shade as well that's projected by that tree? We're gonna cast in that. So you got some rock and you got some shade right there. Should be killer. Yep, I got him. God, wait. No way, dog. I just called that. Got some rock, got some shade. Summertime bass. Dude, he's fighting good too. Look at that, oh snap. I should just let him jump on the bank. Let's flip him up here. Boom, just like that. Oh, gosh. Dude, we just started. That might have been my second cast there. Look at his lips, red lips. Got a little bit of lipstick going. Right there, crawl right in his mouth. Not a big one, but man, that's a healthy, chunky guy. Look how fat his body is. The fish out here are so, just so beautiful. Let's get him back in the water. Oh, that's sweet. Right there, that is awesome. Five minutes in, baby on the crawl and just note that we barely paid any money for this that's the point of this video like if you guys are seriously balling on a budget like seriously balling on a budget you know i'd like you guys to get some of the premium tackle that's going to last you a little bit longer but when it comes to this and soft plastics man it's pretty basic and i mean i went out bought it you know the whole thing five dollars just caught a fish on it in five minutes and this place is not easy to fish i would like to try to catch some more fish right now but i'm running late so i'm gonna catch you guys tomorrow morning on the kayak we're gonna do some pure just kayak fishing. Nothing more than just kayak fishing. Catch you guys there. Let's get it. Ooh, that was close. Oh, a little windy. Oh, we're gonna have a fish on my pole by the time we grab it. Oh, I got one. Oh gosh, right away. Oh, he's a good one, he's a good one. Right away. Oh, 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 wind is whipping. We just got out here about five minutes ago. Got about two pounder. Okay, right on that rock. I'm gonna get down. Okay, buddy, calm down. Boom, boom, baby. He ate that sucker too. He ate it just how you want him to. What you think about that for the first fish today? He ain't quite two pounds, he's about a pound and three quarters. He is a thick body though. We're gonna put the worm down, crankbait out. Gosh. 
Got him on the crankbait. Right away on the rock. He slammed it. I can't tell if he's big or not. He feels pretty good. Oh, yep. Yep, 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 yep. Don't bring me up on the spot. Don't bring me up on the spot. Oh, he's barely hooked. Oh, he's barely hooked. <laughs> Look at that. Right off the bat. Six cents crank and juice color. I'm nicknaming this color, man. It's the juice color. I have cremated these fish on this crankbait. Unbelievable, man. We've been here for five minutes. I pick up the crank. First cast on that, I get it down there and he slammed it. Like, instantly. It didn't even take me reeling it for about two to three seconds. Been out here for five minutes. Whipped out the crank. Got smacked. I like that a lot. <laughs> All right, Jimmy. Thank you.